My name is Jan from Perez Cosmetics and today I'm going to be talking about how to use our phytotherapy line from our Perez products. So first of all I'm going to be talking about one of the key ingredients. So in our restorative face and eye cream and in our new product which is the phytotherapy eye firming serum and our marine algae firming gel they all have one key ingredient in common and that is marine algae from the sea now the reason why i love marine algae for use on the skin it has a particular affinity with the skin it contains a lot of minerals but one of the things it does do is that it, as well as remineralizing the skin, it also helps with strengthening the skin as well. And I have been using the, the marine algae for myself for over 30 years. And every time I have felt like my skin is becoming a little loose anywhere around the eyes or on the neck, I immediately have started using the algae products. So these are not new products, but they are new to Perez. So first of all, let's talk about each individual product. So some of you might be already familiar with the Phytotherapy Restorative Eye and Face Cream. Now this is a very light product. It can be used on all skin types and it also contains ingredients such as rose and immortel and this cream was specifically developed for people with allergy prone rosacea skin so if you've got any um, irritation any inflammation in the skin it will help to calm and tone it down the same for acne as well so it won't clog the pores there's many other ingredients here, hyaluronic acid, etc. And you can read about each one individual. But this one can be, this cream can be used around the eyes, on the neck, and all over the face, morning and in the evening, for oily and also for dry skin. The next one that we have had in stock for a while is the Phytotherapy Marine Algae Firming Gel. Now, this is what I consider the big guns. So what it is, it's very, it's, um, it's got a lot of essential oil of cypress in it and frankincense. Now, cypress essential oil, what it does, it firms the skin. So it's been used, for example, on hemorrhoids and on varicose veins to help the skin tighten. So it helps to tighten the skin. Traditionally, this has been used more for neck firming and lower face firming. It can be used around the eyes, but not too close to the eyes itself. And I'll talk a little bit about how to use this later. And basically, this is the same product, but in a weaker form for use around the eyes. So let's go to the, uh, the cleansing and the toning. So in this line, we just carry one cleansing lotion. Of course, in our Perez range, we have a lot of different cleansing lotions and toners. And this is very simple. It is great for oily and dry skin because it contains, contains the essential oil of geranium. And let me show you, I'm gonna show you now how we're gonna use it. So first of all, when you get this, you just twist the knob here. And I would suggest to save yourself money, let's get yourself two damp cotton wool pads, dampen them first, and then literally use, I'm gonna remove all my makeup here so you're gonna see it all coming off. So you've got your cleansing lotion here. This is how I would suggest you best use it. You can also just put it in your hand and wipe over your face and wipe off. So let me, let me remove my glasses. So first of all, to remove around the eyes, 
I've got my cleanser here. You start on the outside of the eye. You go across the eyelid, up and under. As you can see here, it's coming off. So this cleanser is strong enough to remove eye makeup and mascara. And then I just want to do, so I've gone across, up, under, and then I sometimes just go under, just to sweep out. Then I'm going to do the other side. I'm not going to remove my lipstick right now, but um, basically do the same thing with lipstick. For the face, again, this is where you could actually use your hands, wipe over and then just use um, uh, the konjac uh, sponge to remove it or the damp cotton wool and you just literally wipe and I would suggest for the firming actually wipe around, out, across firmly, across firmly, up, always on the up and out and you never forget, now you see the makeup is coming off here and never forget the neck. Now with the neck to get yourself a little bit of exercise, you can put your neck right back, excuse me, looking at my nostrils, and you can go up and down. And this gives a little bit of an exercise, and then you can go up and up. So it's always affirming up, out, out. Now once you've cleansed, I would suggest you clean, use the cleansing lotion twice then use your toning lotion. Now I personally, our toners actually come in the spray, but I am actually going to be giving an offering that people can actually get it in pump form, because I prefer to use this in pump form. Now this toning lotion again is a mixture of cucumber, hydrosol, rose, witch hazel, and also the essentials of geranium and lavender. So it's quite refreshing. And again, use it on damp cotton wool, that will save you money on your toner. And you do the same principle, out, out, under, under, and then up. And then for the eyes, again, you could actually just lay it on the eyes, or again, the same principle, across, up, under, across, up, under, and so I think I've got a pretty clean face here now, so this is me with no makeup on whatsoever. Now when you are um, applying these products I show you how you can use all three but very often all I will use is my restorative cream but if you feel you're getting a lot of wrinkling here, like a jowls or lines across your neck, then I really would suggest getting the firming gel. Now this is a bit tricky to work with, so we always use these two items first before the cream. So to use the gel, take off the top and we just squish it in and we remove a little bit of the gel. Put it in the center of your hand, just warm it up slightly. Now the thing with this gel is it's very sticky at the beginning. So again, just apply it, and I just apply it to my neck and to the lower face. Now it feels like a tingling sensation, which means the action is happening but it also feels sticky and that's really what you're after. Eventually the stickiness will go away. It's only just sticky when you first start to use it. Now I'm going to let that sit for a while while I apply my eye firming serum. So again it's in a roller format. You also have it in a dropper. Um, you again, how you use this one is you roll it across, over, up, under. 
and then you can just use your ring finger to massage it in. I've just got to get it going. This is very effective, it's a metal roller and it's very nice on a feel on the skin around the eyes. And when you've got the product on your eyes, just go over, over the eyelid, up and over. It's not a same stickiness as the other product. So I feel my feel kind of alive now. Finally, so that's using everything, of course. Then I finally apply a little bit of cream. And again, just apply on top of the gel. Now that is the full application. You could do that once a day and then the rest of the day, um, on, say if you, you do this in the morning, at the evening just apply this. You don't have to do the eye firming serum and the marine algae twice a day. Just once a day is enough, but it's the continued use of it that works. Um, also in these creams and, and in the algae it helps again it helps with sun protection so it does protect your skin from any sunburn although you do need some additional sunscreen if you're actually going to go sunbathing so if you would like to know a little bit more about the products or wish to speak to me personally about your skincare regime and what you can do to improve it do please contact me and it's bye for now.